You have keratoconus, a condition where the clear part of the eye, known as the cornea, will thin over time. This thinning will cause the shape of the cornea to change and may eventually lead to scarring and other complications. Doc, what are my treatment options? Treatment options depend on the stage of the condition in which you present. You see, glasses and soft contact lenses are good options in the very early stages of keratoconus. However, these options limit your vision because they don't actually correct for the changes happening at your cornea. Corneal gas permeable lenses and scleral lenses are better options for the later and more advanced stages of this condition. Specialty lenses are an excellent option because they can help patients achieve their highest visual potential. You mentioned soft contact lenses, gas permeable contact lenses, and scleral contact lenses. What are their differences? <laughs> That's a very good question. Soft contact lenses, as the name suggests, are soft and take on the shape of your cornea. They can also be folded and manipulated unlike the other options we are going to discuss. Corneal gas permeable lenses are small, hard, and fit over the colored part of the eye. Scleral lenses, as the name suggests, sit on the white part of your eye known as the sclera. They are then vaulting over the cornea and the colored part of the eye known as the iris. They are also special because they are filled with a saline solution. Is there any way to stop keratoconus from worsening? Yes. There is a procedure called cross-linking. Corneal cross-linking is a preventative treatment option and the only procedure that may halt the progression of keratoconus. It works best when performed during the early stages of the disease. It's an in-office procedure where we use vitamin B2 drops and controlled UV light to strengthen the collagen bonds in our cornea. Note that you will still need to wear contact lenses even after cross-linking. Late and very severe stages of keratoconus may require the patient to undergo a corneal transplant. This is a surgical option that involves risk, so we do love to exhaust our non-surgical options first. This is because patients can see very well using contact lenses. That being said, there are certain disease states where the patient can only gain functional vision through a corneal transplant. It's important to know that there are treatment options for every stage of keratoconus. You just have to keep in mind that the earlier your keratoconus is treated, the better the overall visual outcomes.